Sequences statistics let you see the overall performance of your sequence. You can check it on the Stats tab of any sequence. The tab includes the filters, key metrics and graphs, and detail view sections. You can filter the stats by the time filter, which means you can select the time period for displaying the stats. By default, you see last week's stats, but you can also select all time, last month, last year, or set a custom date range. To apply the custom date range filter, click the time drop-down list, select the custom date range option, and set the needed date range in the calendar. Key metrics reflect the sequence performance for each prospect. This means that they show you the total number of people contacted, regardless of the number of emails sent to each of them. The key metrics section contains statistics that help you measure the success of your sequence. Total people is the number of contacts that currently participate in sequence and have received any step emails, including step one and follow-ups, counts as a one, consists of both contacted people and not reached. Contacted, it's a number of contacts that received your emails, excludes not reached. Delivery rate, it's a number of delivered emails and ratio between the total people and the contacted metric, contains contacted plus out of office. Open rate is the number of people who opened email. The open rate is calculated on the basis of the contacted metric. Reply rate is the number of replying contacts. The reply rate is also calculated on the contacted metric basis. Interested metric shows how many contacts were interested in your email. The metric uses an intricate algorithm based on numerous factors. The opts outs rate metric shows how many people unsubscribe from your email after opening it. The not reached metric shows how many emails have not been delivered for a variety of reasons, consists of out of office, bounced, and auto replied prospects. Out of office, the email that was delivered but the recipient has set the automatic out of office reply. Bounced means the email could not be delivered because the recipient email does not exist. Auto reply, it's the email that was delivered but the recipient has set the automatic reply for all incoming emails. The data on this page is displayed based on the time zone set in the account settings. The detail view section lets you see the sequence statistics based on steps. There are two views, brief and detailed. The brief view provides the compact view. You can see which template was used in each particular step, as well as delivery rate, open rate, reply rate, and interested key metrics. The detailed view displays also opts out rate, and not reached key metrics. The slider is used for A-B testing variants and shows the performance of a particular variant in a sequence step. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us via at support at reply.io. Thank you.